Home of Chad. We're going to check out Disney's uh, fireworks shoot site. They have a um, project going on back here. Let's see if they, we can see what the project is. Oh, look. That's something boo. Halloween stuff on there. Back to the entrance for the cast members. Let's see if we can see what the uh, construction is that they got going on around here. That's where they shoot all their fireworks from. I don't see any kind of construction going on. Looks the same to me. It's the back of the park. Doesn't look any different to me. But they have a permit for a fireworks um, renovation or some type of renovation for the fireworks. So, whatever that means. Just driving around. There's a deer. See the deers? I don't know if you saw them or not. There's a lot of deer on Disney property. I like coming here and looking at the deer. Deer, 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 deer. Back entrance of Splash Mountain area, Thunder Mountain. And this brings us around to Floridian Way. Thinking about going to Disney Springs for a little bit. Just like a quick minute. Just to look around for a minute. Depending on how busy it is. Let's see. There's some deer over there. Let's see if there's any horned deer or if they're all does. Just does. Disney deer. Hi deer. Hi deer. No bucks. Last time I was here the bucks were all in velvet. Which means they were growing their antlers back. So they're all fuzzy. And then they rub trees to get all the velvet off of them. find a spot to make a u-turn so I can go back towards Disney's property even though I'm on Disney property now I don't usually ever come this way I may just go back I can go back by uh, the Tron coaster and show you guys the progress on the Tron coaster it's all back lot Disney backlot stuff back here. So like where the cast members park, where they work on the man the trains, powers the power sources, the Reedy Reedy Creek uh, Reedy Creek. Um, Water source. That's all the cast member parking for the back of the park. I'm gonna go back by the Tron coaster. Show sure you guys the progress on that from the back side. If I can figure out how to get back there. I think I made a wrong turn. You can see the crane. That's my landmark. The crane looks like it's over the castle, but it's not. Oh, can't. Yeah, I can't turn it here. Some of the areas are just for cast members. I'm trying to figure out how to get back to this road over here. There's Disney University. I think I'm locked in. 
trying to figure out how to get out of here. Don't know if I can. We'll get on that road over there. I'm not sure if I'm able to. I'm gonna take a wrong turn down Albuquerque Way. all cast member parking. The buses pick up the cast members around here and then they bring them to the back of the Magic Kingdom. Here's where they do all the work on the transportation stuff back here. Transportation maintenance, boats. They have harbors back there for a great store, but for Christmas stuff in this warehouse here, the holiday service. Got a huge warehouse storage area for that. The shops takes care of all the rides they got the textile services where they clean all the linens and stuff for the for the some of the uh things here's the where the monorails going to the monorail cleaning thing or the repair shop so the trains go in that's the big top in front of us big top concessions where that's from. Where that bus just came out You can see it says boo something on there for Halloween. Like I said, they're replacing every piece of track on the railroad line. The monorail, to the monorails park. Come back, we'll look at the Tron coaster from the backside. Get a lot of the building completed. So they have more of the structure for that um, for the others the other little if you've ever seen it in Tokyo Disney here's more cast member parking on this side storage stuff maintenance on things that's a Tron coaster building coming along good Got a lot of scaffolding up like I said, they're putting that uh, metal structure that has that, like, see that white metal dome-like um, covering that goes over it? Just looks like So, now we're coming back by the Contemporary and Bailey Towers. It's always beautiful. Love it out here. Love it, love it, love it. That's why I come here so often. Chilling with Chad. Let's go look for some more deer by... Monorail. There it goes. Bye bye, Monorail. They're driving back by Wilderness Lodge, trying to see some wildlife on the side of the road. Let's see what we come up with. It's really pretty back here. Doesn't even look like Disney property. Right around the corner is Disney. I mean, we're on Disney property, but it seems like we're in, a, in the woods. They have 41 square miles of property. It's a lot of property. Oh, we 
we've seen deer over here before. Nothing today. Oh, there's some bucks. Two bucks. Big bucks. Look at how nice those are. Two nice bucks. He's still in velvet. They're both in velvet. Very cool. That's what I wanted to see. See if we can see any more wildlife. See what they are. There's the Fort Wilderness Resort. The campgrounds. Or just the campgrounds. No bucks, just does. All those. It's cool to see those bucks. Usually they get in packs like that when they're around just before mating season. Then they start battling over the females. There's the parking for the campgrounds. Everybody brings their trailers and stuff like that to drive around. There's Four Seasons entrance. Then you have the backside of Golden Oak. Million dollar homes. Used to be a golf course, now it's, now it's homes. One of my favorite pictures is from Golden Oak. It's a Golden Oak tree with, I want to say it's 40, Two hidden Mickeys in the picture, maybe more. I can't remember, I think it's 42. And there's the entrance to Golden Oak. But the artist that made the painting for Golden Oak Somebody requested it that lives in Golden Oak and he has the original painting and it is humongous. I didn't want to say it was around like $60,000 or something crazy. People that live in there can afford it. It's a $60,000 painting. I bought a reprint during the art festival at Epcot. Met the artist, he signed it. So, it's pretty cool. I just love their property. Somebody out here fishing. They, I'd imagine there's some big bass in these lakes. Like I said, they got 41 square miles, twice the size of Manhattan. Huge, huge property. it out here in the parks outside the parks they just it's just home away from home I'm getting to learn the roads a lot better than I used to ever know just like going this way to Disney Springs the back roads so we're coming we're coming up by the Key West Resort. I always keep it looking really nice and sharp over there. And then the treehouse villas. I don't know if you'll be able to see one of the tree houses in there or not. The treehouse villas are along here too. One of their golf courses off to the side. Well, there's the treehouse villas are back there. They're kind of off in the side a little bit. Kind of can see one, but eh, it's not. I can see it, but you guys probably couldn't. But it's just so wildernessy over here. Mini bus. Another side of the golf courses. So I'm gonna see if I can go to Saratoga Springs. They have one of my favorite 
desserts if they have it available i'm gonna buy one maybe two because it is my absolute favorite cupcake they have on property see if they let me in this place see you guys on the other side